हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम टू इन्फॉर्मेटिका सपोर्ट वीडियोज दिस इज प्रियंता फ्रॉम इन्फॉर्मेटिका जी सी एस टूडे इन दिस पार्ट ऑफ सी डी आई पी सी प्ले लिस्ट वी आर गोइंग टू कवर हाउ टू मैनेज अ सी डी आई पी सी डोमेन द एजेंडा ऑफ टूडेज वीडियो इज हाउ टू मैनेज अ सी डी आई पी सी डोमेन वॉट ऑल एक्शन कैन बी परफॉर्म ऑन अ सी डी आई पी सी डोमेन फॉलोड बाई ए क्विक डेमो सेशन टू स्टार्ट विथ we have to first log in to the idmc console once you have the credential you can log in to the idmc console once we log in in idmc we can see multiple checklists out of which we have to select cloud data integration for power center once we click on cdi pc checklist we will be landing on this home page where we have to select manage your domains Once we click on manage your domains this particular page will be visible where you can see all the domains which are registered within this org will be listed here please note we can see all the domains here which already has registered with this org id and with one org id you can register multiple domains as you might have different environment like prod test and dev to manage your domain means you can verify the domain details is current status how many nodes and services are configured within this domain if the domain is in latest version or not and if there is any new update available all the node and services status also will be visible from this page and you can monitor or manage your domain from here as we can see in this page that there are multiple domains available for example the first domain you can see the domain name version and the status it says it's available and the second domain which is listed here that is also available but the third domain if you can see here it says the status is offline to view each domain details we can click on the same once we click on the domain it will display the domain details in this page on the left hand side you can see the domain name domain gateway host name gateway node port number security agent details and created on created by all the details and in the right hand side top you can see the current version and the next available update and what is the update status below we will have the node details and the services details how many nodes are available in this domain and how many services are configured on this particular domain as we have seen in the previous cdi pc playlist that these are the main three steps to convert a pc domain to a cdi pc domain in the previous part we have already seen how to install and register a cdi pc domain today in this part we are going to cover what action can be performed on the cdi pc domain please note action means like administration updates patching etc of cdi pc domain are now being automatically carried out by idmc in today's video we will check the cdi pc domain update process update a cdi pc domain to start with the update process select the domain you wish to update and click on it once you click on a domain you can verify the update status if there is any update available you can proceed for the same to update a cdi pc domain you have to click on view update plan Once you click on view update plan then this update domain page will get open where you can see all the update related details like which version you are going to update which node and all the phase for a update process to give more background let un let's understand what exactly happens when we do an update if you see the steps from here like prepare for update begin update updating clean up finalize and final status so once the process starts the updates are pushed from idmc or informatica cloud side to the cdi pc domain side when the update starts cdi pc domain will be shut down by the command given by domain management app which is running on a secure agent machine then it will push the changes to the cdi pc domain side and once done it will restart the services again If we compare with existing on-prem power center it's like installing 
or upgrading to a new version. The update package can contain any runtime entities or libraries related details. Please note it's a one click or one time activity and can be monitored or managed from IDMC console. If you are scheduling the update, you can plan your update window as per your convenience as domain downtime is required. In multi node setup, all the nodes will get updated. You can constantly monitor the update status from IDMC. If the update fails, you can see the error message. You can go back to the domain and check for the detailed error logs. You can rectify the errors, come back again and resume the update from the point where you stopped last time. As you can see in this page, from the top right hand side, you have to click on update domain to start the update process. Moving forward, once you click on update domain, it will start the update process and you can monitor the progress from here. Like we can see in this page, currently it is in progress and 0%. Then it will be 40% and like once the update is completed, it will give you that completed successfully 100%. Now we will proceed for a quick demo session. To manage or update a CDI PC domain, first we have to log in to the IDMC console. Once we log in to the IDMC console, we have to select cloud data integration for power center chiclet. Once we click on CDI PC chiclet, we will be landing on this home page from where we will select manage your domains. Once we click on manage your domains, all the domains which is available in this particular org will be listed here. To verify more details about any domain, you can click on the domain and you can proceed further. In this particular page, if you see all the domains is listed along with the status and all the details. Like for example, the first domain status is available and the how many nodes are available there and how many services are present. Also, this is another domain and the status is offline. Like that, you can see all the domain details which are registered or listed in this particular org. You can click on this domain to verify more details. In this particular page, if you see, we can see the domain details on the left hand side and in the right hand side, we can see the update details. Like what is the update status, what is the current version, if and if any next available update is available. How many nodes are present in this particular domain and how many services are configured in this domain. And what is the status of this node and the services. To proceed further, we can click on view update plan. As we have seen in the PPT, once you click on view update plan, it will open the update domain page. From here, you can click on update domain to start the update process. To proceed with the update, we will click on update domain. Next, update domain. Here, we have to give the domain username and the password. We will click on update domain. Now it will start the update process. You can constantly monitor the update status from IDMC console. Like in this page, it, you can see that's completed successfully 100%. That means the update is completed. That's all for today's video. You can provide a feedback by visiting support videos at the rate You can also reach us on Twitter. Thank you for watching this video.